Historians and archaeologists now believe that over time and around the world the amount of violence in which people are killed has been going down. Why do you think this is the case? What can be done to make sure violence stays low? According to the experts of history and professionals of archaeology, as time passes the death of people in violent conflicts is reducing drastically. This article aims to find out some possible reasons for this change. Additionally, it will also try to look into some solutions to keep violence in check. Comparing the past and present data of people getting killed in violent encounters, historians come to the conclusion that killings all over the world are decreasing. There are three major reasons for this positive change. First and the major cause is development of democracies in this world. It has reduced the number of wars between kings and nations who are living in harmony under the flagship of United Nations. The second important cause is the level of education among people which leads to higher literacy and people understand the importance of life. The last factor affecting reduced killing might be improved lifestyle of people which lessens the crime rate in the country. Citizens believe it is better to do business in a civilized manner than to engage in criminal activities. The ways to keep uh, fatalities low are covered by their causes only. If democratic governments are promoted, people will have more power to pass laws to reduce arms and weapons in society. Education will improve their life standards which in turn will help them improve their lives by engaging in business and keeping them away from crime. So, fewer people will lose their valuable lives. To conclude, historians and archaeologists rightly judge the reduction of mass killings of people for the above mentioned reasons. The solutions are always there to live and let live.